Hi, I'm back and I'm so excited because it's MT's videos times and if you like to see stuff that I loved and finished or didn't do like but had to finish those products, please keep on watching. Alright, so let's get started. I finished this great value 100% extra virgin olive oil and this is the one I say it's great for dipping, um, for dips and stuff like that and cook with. However, I use this in my hair, I use it um, in face mask, I use it to take off my makeup and I finish a whole one. I don't mix this with the ones that are in my kitchen because, well, I don't want to contaminate it and all that, all that kind of stuff. So I just keep it in my room to use on whatever beauty treatment I am doing so I also use it as to moisturize my hair and all this kind of stuff love it will repurchase or of course I have repurchased that um finish this wetty um wipes this had a hundred pieces inside it's usually 72 but they had an extra 28 and this was really inexpensive I think I paid something like um what would be equivalent to like two US for it so it was nice, enjoy using it. Um, the packaging is kind of tacky. When I repurchase right now, I um, have quite a few wipes that I'm going to use up first. And if when I'm finished there, if it's available still, if there's nothing you want to try out, it will be a repurchase. I finished this Daily Defense um, Argan Oil from Morocco shampoo that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. Um, I like the shampoo more than the conditioner and i would repurchase for the price it is it works pretty decent and i don't regret purchasing it also from the dollar tree i picked up was this um vanilla brown sugar scent body wash from april bath and showers will repurchase these because for the price again i just think they work really really well april yes another body wash this one is same april bath and shower but the tropical scent i like both scents i don't know if i can choose i I actually really like both scents. Use this in a day many times, and I use that one at night. Would repurchase both of them. I finished this Ole Professional Pro X Exfoliating Renewal Cleanser. Really liked it. Got it with my Pro X um, brush. Love that brush. Would definitely recommend you guys to get it. I've had it for um like two years now i think pretty much when it came out i bought it and have been using it you just need to change the heads um of them it does come with two and you can buy like a replacement check amazon for that and it came with a cleanser they said that i bought came with a cleanser but now i use other cleansers when i started using it i was using another cleanser and then eventually i started using that and i absolutely love that so if i can repurchase that i will I finally finished this Mega Care Macadamia Nuts Oil. I think this is like my third one of this. I really like it, would recommend it, and it has a very pleasant scent. Um, it's not 100% Macadamia Nuts Oil, but um, it's pretty good. I must say it's pretty good. It's $8.95, which is like $1.25, $1.20 US. And if you go to the Mega Care site or the Via, because Via, I think, or Via, they also make this. It's about $1.99. If you check Amazon, it's about $1.99 US. I did finish this Night Magic from Avon. It's their perfume skin softener. I have a vlog about this on my vlog channel, Sweets RV, S W E E T Z R V. I'll have it in the link below. And this was what? 150 ml of product, and I liked it. Really, really liked it. And um, will repurchase this. I'm going to look for the faraway scent because I do like the faraway perfume but this scent if I can't get that I'll repurchase this same scent it was really really nice I finished this tea tree daily use cleansing wipes facial wipes I have um, a review on this up already and this is maybe number four I'm using number five right now I love it will repurchase it as usual I always finish a deodorant and a student antiperspirant deodorant from Lady Speed Sick Wild Freezer. Like I said, I purchased these in the Dollar Tree and I usually pick up a bunch of them so that I, you know I use one every month, so sometimes a little more than that. This is a liner brush. I most likely got this off of eBay or Postal Sands and I've had it for years. I started using back gel liners and in the process realized this one was kind of frayed out so. 
um I just decided not to use it and just I had a backup so I pulled out the backup to use but this um if you buy it on eBay they're like 99 cents so it's a no-brainer I've had this eyelash curler for maybe two years purchased it on eBay for 99 cents it had labeled show mirror but I know it wasn't so it wasn't like I got tricked but it did work amazing 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 and I didn't really want to give up on it but the pads here is really worn and it started like I find it would tug at my lashes I really was trying to get another pad to fit into it but this here is so small um, smaller than most others and so uh, the other ones that I have from eBay or from e.l.f. the pads will not fit in it so I was really bummed out um, have been looking for it on eBay again but I'm not seeing it for 99 cents but I have like one from BH Cosmetics and I have one from eBay so another one from eBay but it's not like that if I can find it back I will repurchase this is a Smashbox Hyper Lash Mascara got this in um a kit, a Smashbox kit, Smashbox kit. I purchased another one of the kits Christmas. This mascara is not super fantastic for me. However, I find that it does separate your lashes. I find that when I do apply, um, I usually apply mascara, then I line my lash, my upper lid, and when I do that, sometimes the lashes do clump, and I use that to separate. It's more of a, to me, it's more like a lengthened mascara finish one of these fuzzies um this should have been in last month's empties but i forgot to take it out of my shower so it's in this month's empties um i got this one in walmart and i think i paid like 99 cents and uh, inexpensive would repurchase it i really like it this is also from the dollar tree it's same daily defense but this one is a keratin enrich this was a conditioner um this was okay would repurchase this if i did not get the shampoo with it only got the conditioner would repurchase if i ever see it um one powder puff um bottom body works antibacterial and you know i go through these um this is a one from april april bottom showers this one was ocean breeze scented i think that one i had it in the car this illegal fine line it says long lasting and it does last pretty long on your lid it does I had, had no problem but it just dried up way too fast to me would not repurchase it just because it dried up so fast I would definitely put money towards the Giordana Fabulina instead and what got an elf kit and opened the mascara and it was like gunk so it was no use but it's in an empties I think I have another one. I don't know. Maybe I just trash it. Finished a fresh and soft makeup remover and wipes. This one is for normal to combination skin. $7.95. I have seen these at Grandpa's App Pennywise for $6.95. They just keep fluctuating the price. Will repurchase that, but I have like five backups of it. I'm currently using one. I think I have like four backups. That's to tell you how much. Um, this is a double eco lifestyle. Um, mask this is these are like paper masks and this one is just for healthy looking skin um, this one has seaweed in it this just fine gives you like a nice picker up or brightens your face if you feel if your face looks dull and out of it that really picks it up um, but I have quite others I have like potato and lemon pomegranate tea, green tea etc this is another makeup um removal wipes from fresh and soft this is dry sensitive i use both they don't um to me don't matter to me and this one was 6.95 and like i said i saw the blue ones on 6.95 also don't know what's up with the changing of prices finish this amber blush very early in the month like finish it so totally love this scent this I have so much bottom body wigs that really and truly I can't say now that I repurchase it. But if I can and I'm ever finished, yeah, I repurchase it. I think I have body products for the next 10 years from bottom body wigs. Okay, lie. I use a lotion a month and a splash every two months. So maybe not for the next 10 years. But I have quite a bit and I keep buying still. Estee Lauder Time Zone Line and Wrinkle Reducing Cream with SPF 15. I like this. Use this. Um, I really like the Estee Lauder skincare. Would definitely recommend it. And 
I personally would splurge and put out money to purchase those items. Finish this cutting round. And Marie K hated it. Friend bought two packs because I really want. I wanted another one. Any other one? Actually, I just wanted two packs. But this was horrible. Lint up on me and all that stuff. I spoke about it on my vlog channel. Will definitely stay far from this brand altogether. I have my assured here which is what I absolutely love. These were the cotton um, balls instead of the pads. And um, sometimes I get these for nail polish. So I think that's what that was for, but I love that and I'm always repurchasing it. This is an Amuse cream blush, but it has started to smell horrible. And oh, I don't know why I had to smell it again. And really there's like, it's like getting hard and no peel, so I had to trash it. Then DK and YB Delicious Paris. I think this is the blue one. These, I always have those samples and I love it. And another puff. This was the um, Sarah Mac Nar Mac Nar La. Not going to be pronounced. With the Skin Transformers Vanish Super C Super C Plus. This is just, I don't know, miracle. I've heard people talk about this and purchase full size of this. This was actually really nice. To me it works more like a primer, I um, wouldn't put out a lot of money in it because I think a lot of my other face primers do the same thing. Nothing outrageous and outstanding. And the last item was my Chala um, Brow. This was in Dazzling Dark Brown, Dark Brown Hair. Yeah. And I actually did like it for my brows, it did make my brow, it, this was dark brown so it did, was my brows were bolder. Um, I find a taupe now looks, now that I'm doing my brows quite often. I find that a taupe color could be maybe a brown so I will I don't want to go and purchase anything because I do have like two taupe my Fabi brow and one from La Femme when those are finished I have my second love which I can play around and until after all of those things then I would consider purchasing um something for my brows but I just want to use up these things that I have I'm glad this was this finished it took of course forever those things take forever to finish um, but I'm happy it's finished. So that there is my empties and um, Hope you guys enjoyed this video. It wasn't too too long. Tried to really speed up on my discussion So some things were hit some were missed, but I'm so happy that I finished quite a bit um, Of makeup products. It's not a lot a lot, but there's a couple things well like I mean yours finished mascara But like this I was happy to finish it and I think there was like one other makeup item that I was really happy um, but Makeup items generally take so long, I'm rambling, I know, so, so long to finish so that anytime you have one or two in your empties, it's like a huge accomplishment. And I know some of you will totally level and understand what I'm saying. So let me know what you guys did finish in um, April and maybe what you're hoping to finish this month. I have quite a few things that are borderline in finishing, but I don't even think they will finish. And um, I generally go through like skincare and body stuff much, much faster than hair items struggle along because I have quite a few but yeah let me know what you finish and if you use any of these items mentioned here and what your take um, is on them or are on them depending on how many items you do um, use from what I used here so until next video bye